Alright, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So today we are going to be taking down another one of the new Gods of Destruction for part 2 of Global's Anniversary. And this time it's going to be Beerus' twin brother, Champa, God of Destruction of Universe 6. Now, in the last video when we took down Beerus, even though we got through it with no issues, it didn't really feel that satisfying honestly because the team I used was just way too overpowered, man. I mean, we were using the new reps of Universe 7 with the, you know, AGL LR UI Goku, the LR SSB Vegeta, the STR UI, and so on and so forth. Like, that team is just way too good, honestly. So today, I decided to, you know, change things up a little bit, give myself a little bit more of a challenge. And this team is the... Uh, siblings Bond slash Goku's family with the double LR Go Bros leads. We got the Tech LR Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, the new AGL Tapion EZA, as well as Tech Ultimate Gohan, and of course the uh, Khalifla for dodging purposes. So even though this team is still really solid, it's not nearly as OP as the reps of Universe 7. So I still think we can beat it, it's just gonna be. A bit more of a challenge which is gonna be good so here we go we got Khalifa here and also the GT Go Bros and Gohan so I'm thinking we definitely leave Khalifa in that first slot for all the dodges and then I'm gonna leave ultimate Gohan in the second slot so we can keep stacking his defense and then we'll just give one orb to the Go Bros should be a pretty good rotation I mean if Gohan gets super right now this early, he is going to take some damage, which uh, is a little bit concerning, but I don't think he'll get us killed, even at this point, you know, with his guard and everything, he shouldn't get us killed, so yeah, we're good, we're good. Alright, so Khalifa didn't get supered, so I guess Gohan is going to get supered, or does he not super every turn? Oh, he does, okay, cool. <laughs> Alright, here we go. You know, that wasn't the greatest outcome, but um, it could have been worse, man. It could have been a lot worse, so I'm not going to complain. By the way, these GT Girl Bros are, are really solid. If you guys haven't used them before, like you pulled them or whatever on the Goku banner, and uh, you never gave them a shot, test them out, man. They're actually, they're actually solid. They're actually solid. Okay, so on this turn, we have the double Go Bros. As well as the Tech Gohan. Uh, man, this is where I wish we could use more than one item. Because I would have definitely popped like a, you know, Icarus or a Whis here. Because we don't need the healing. Actually, healing might be a good idea. You know what? I am going to pop the Princess Snake. Just because, you know, the Gobros need to stack up their attack and defense a little bit. So, it's probably a good call. So let's do that. Let's give a nice amount of orbs to my Gohan as well. It's going to be 18 key. Nice. And we'll give these to the other Go Bros. Um, if Champa does super every turn, then the item was a very good idea. Because otherwise, you know, a super right now probably would kill us. Oh, see, nice. Look at that. Yo, the difference that one super attack makes, man, on their defense. Well, yeah, after they've had a chance to, like, stack up a little bit, I won't be too worried about them. Right now, we just got to make sure we don't take any, uh, unexpected supers. Oh, yeah, that Princess Snake was definitely a good call. Now, if he doesn't super me this turn, I'm going to be a little bit sad. Because then it, it would have felt like I wasted <laughs> the Princess Snake. So, uh, let's see, let's see. Additional attack, I like that. Okay. Two additionals. Oh damn, okay, so he doesn't super every turn. That that felt like a bit of a waste. That's okay though. Um, we're gonna once again put Khalifa in the front. We got Tapion at the end, taking that one attack. I feel great about that, so let's just make sure everybody gets their supers off. Here we go. Okay, so so far so good. So far so good. Like using the item turn two is not exactly what I wanna do, but at the same time. We still got the one item left. He's at about 66% HP, I'd say, like a third down. And we're doing some good damage. 
especially if we get some uh, good you know RNG with the additionals. So I think we got this, guys. I think we got this. Now is he gonna super Tapion? Oh. Well, damn, back to back turns with no supers. Oh, okay, all right. Um, let me see. Let's let's actually link up these Gobros. Oh, they only share two links. Let me. What about this? Oh, they share two links too. Okay. Um. Hmm. Let me think. Let me think. I think I'm gonna leave them in the front, and then we'll just give the one orb to these guys. Now, do I need a Princess Snake is the question. I don't think we do. I'm a little bit worried about it. I don't think we do. I think we should be okay. Now, those could be my famous last words. <laughs> those definitely could be my famous last words, man. This could be GG for us, but I'm, I'm gonna trust these guys. I'm gonna trust these guys. I don't like how much damage we're taking from normals, though. It's not a great sign. These guys better get an additional Superman. Oh, please. Additional Super. No! Okay. Oh! Okay. Um. I underestimated them. I was just talking about how people, like, should not be sleeping on these guys, and then I just slept on them. So that's my bad, that's my bad. Yeah, no, they... Their tanking is even better than I thought it would be. <laughs> that's legit, that's legit. Alright. Um, Let's see. Oh, okay, active skills, active skills. Let's uh do this first. Let's pop the GoBros active skill. One that you almost never see, because... The conditions are not the best. I mean, they're not bad, but like, they're not great. So, yeah, I almost never see this animation. It's always nice when I get to use it. So, there we go. Some decent damage too, two million, I'll take that. And then, let's see. Uh, we'll definitely wanna put Ultimate Gohan in front of the two attacks. And, I don't think we need an item at all, but maybe just to be safe. Why risk it? We're so close, why risk it? So I'm gonna heal up here. And uh, let's just give a couple orbs to her. Uh, let me see. How do we play this properly? Okay, let me just give... i give these to Ultimate Gohan. I did not do it right. Okay, that's my bad. <laughs> I thought they would drop differently. Yo, at this point, even after playing the game for so long, I still don't fully understand. Like, I, for the most part, I think like I, I have a good feel for it. But sometimes, sometimes, I still make the mistake of like clicking a, a certain orb thinking that they would drop differently and they don't drop the way I think they will so then you know I don't get like the the right combination it, it, it's, it's fine though it's fine though we still got this we still got this easy dub easy dub this is gonna do like no damage yeah there we go 20k <laughs> so yeah it's gonna take one more turn for us to beat him so it's going to be, what, six turns instead of five? No big deal. No big deal. Okay, so here we go. Um, yeah, we're going to leave GoBros in front. That's going to be 18 key for them. Nice. Actually, we got the double GoBros. I just realized it's the GoBros rotation. It took me a while to actually register that. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we got nice super from them. If that doesn't finish it, then... The other two guys, the Tapion and the GT Go Bros, should finish the job. They should finish the job. I think it should be enough. Maybe, maybe we need an additional super. These guys do consistently get additionals though. So, ooh, yo, we might we might be just short. Actually, we might just be like, oh god. Oh no. Oh, okay, we're good. <laughs> okay, 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 we're good, we're good, we're good. Um. Hey, you know what? Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's end it off on a high note. Let's let's pop this super long active skill animation. 
But you know, usually when you're using this guy, you you never want to pop his active skill. So um, now that we're at the end, you might as well, right? So there we go. Got our ultimate Gohan. Uh, gonna give one orb to her and this guy to get it done for us. Let me see his defense real quick. Yeah, still really good, man. 313k. Really, really good. Guaranteed dodge. Nine damage. Dodge. Dodge. And... I love that smug-ass grin on Gohan's face. It's great. There we go. There we go. Done. Ah, Well, guys, that was fun. Um, I think I will start doing more of these, like alternative teams you know instead of like just my most op team like I i've been doing uh just like gt heroes or reputable Verse 7 two of the most op teams in the game right but i just feel like it makes a lot more sense to you know try different teams like that's 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 the fun of it that's the challenge right like the challenge is the fun of the game in my opinion and like if i'm just using like the most powerful team every time and using the same team every time, it just gets boring. Like, I could beat all the bosses with literally one team. If I use Reps Universe 7, there's no way I won't beat every single uh, God of Destruction, but it's just not interesting that way. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the slight change up today with the GoBros, with the, you know, um, Simply Spawned. So I'll try doing that more for the other videos. And uh, that's going to be today's video, guys. Oh, actually, this is a different team that we used. Okay, so, so full disclosure, before I did Siblings Bond slash uh, Goku's Family, I tried to use this team, the uh, Joined Forces team, and it didn't quite work out. It didn't quite work out. I think I think the double Go Bros, Goku's Family, Siblings Bond, is definitely still the way to go. So definitely go with that if you guys can. Obviously, there are other combinations that can work as well. There are a lot of other teams that can also get the job done, but this is... What I decided to go with, and it's it's pretty good. It's pretty effective. So there you go. That is today's video. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.